Hello friends, I'm Dr. Rohit Shetty here representing Narayan Netralaya Cornea Clinic. One of the most complex diseases I have uh, worked on in the last 25 years is a disease called keratoconus. This is one of the major cause of strain and vision deprivation in a lot of young people today. It was once in the ratio of 1 is to 10,000 but now we are seeing between one is to two or three thousand and sometimes even higher. What do they come to me with? A vision like this. They say everything is blurry. One. They say I've gone to multiple places. They've given me different glasses. I spend a lot of money on glasses. But my vision still changes. I checked my glasses yesterday, but today I it is it's different. I can't focus. I can't drive in the night. The light is too glary on me. The question comes is, what is really a keratoconus? And what can we do to change this kind of vision to something like what we see? So at Nara Netralaya, the last 25 odd years, we have been dedicated to the keratoconus work. We started looking at keratoconus where how a cornea changes its shape and this changing shape, how we can remodel it, how can we reshape it. We use targeted therapies. And maybe the next year, I'll be talking to you with a genetic or gene therapy based thing, which will be the first ever therapy done indigenously in the country. And this will be the first therapy in the world. So now, if you look at what is keratoconus, we have to be really careful about how do you stabilize this beautiful cornea here. How it has been sculpted by this Michelangelo in his, in his poster sculpted marble image. How do you create that a perfect reshaping to the cornea? When you look at keratoconus, you look at how this change can occur. The changes can occur because of allergy, you rub your eyes, you know, constant rubbing. You're prone because you're genetic, you are environmental, you know, you're exposed to uh, environment, the, the, it could be dry eye, it could be related to uh, the changes in exposure to your blue light. We believe that the blue light does have an impact on the quality of the ocular cells. Now let's look at what happens. These are images done in our lab. When you expose your cells to excessive of dryness, look at the cells and look at these cells. These are healthy cells. These are the enzymes which maintains the integrity of it. And look at this. They're all dying. The cells are not healthy at all. When they're not healthy at all, you end up in a keratoconus. So we use different technologies to study the collagen itself. Again, this is something which is only there in the world at Naraneta to look at how the collagen is. People would use the topography. This is something which we call it the handmade hand. This is something which is very unique because we look how your collagen structures are and why the structures would change it into this. So what is the treatment? We observe with drops, we do some lasers, there are DALC, there are CARES, there are multiple things. So what we propose is whatever we do, we have to visually rehabilitate them. Visually rehabilitating them is very important because I showed you the blurred image, you need to get the perfect image of that. How do you visually rehabilitate them? This one is cross-linking. Cross-linking is you take them, use a riboflavin drops, use a blue light with a wavelength. There is a chemical reaction which causes the collagen to fuse. The collagen will something like this and they fuse. So, but what is the advantage is it stops the cornea from becoming weaker. The cornea is like, well, collagen is weak, cornea becomes weaker. If I do a cross-linking, it fuses. In your fridge, you throw water in your freezer you get in whatever shape you want. That's cross-linking because you freeze at that moment. But I don't want that. 
I want to shape the change the shape of the cornea. I want the shape to be become better. Now what do I do? Then I have to put a water like a cube and then I get a cube. So what we introduced today in the corneal remodeling and reshaping at Narayan Netralaya is one of the India's first and of the most advanced corneal reshaping machine which has come out from Italy. They are the world leaders in how you reshape the cornea, the world leaders in how you make the cornea more regular, the world leaders in in PRK so surface ablation. So what does it do? It tries to give you a perfect shape and then I do a freezing. Like I do not freeze at this stage or this stage. It freezes at a shape which is physiological so that I can get something like how you put water in your cube and it uses a ray tracing principle. Now, it is just like a Michelangelo. What did he do? The marble was already there. He chiseled out things which were not necessary. He says, I did not create any model of David. I just removed what was not necessary. So what does ray tracing do is it changes or knocks off things which are creating a tilt or causing an imbalance with your vision. That comes from the machine which takes the image and then you have all the layers of your cornea given here. It measures your pupil size. It uses the quality of vision as an assessment. That means it gives you every layer, 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 layer assessment of your cornea. Then, at the end of it, it makes a plan only for you. That's the most beautiful thing. It's not making a plan, a one size fit for all. It makes a plan for X, Y, Z. This is a laser. It's a very simple procedure. It is a plan and you see, the, this is, you don't, you don't need injection. It's just trying to create the shape of a cornea and it's trying to change the shape it takes around one and a half minutes to do that and it's already trying to knock off whatever is not wanted. The shape is gone and now after this, this just, and this is done, you do a cross-linking, you put a bandage contact lens in three days. So what happens is you tremendously change the quality of vision. You leapfrog the quality of vision from a blurry image to something totally different. So what do we get out of this? This is the planning, what went into the laser. Now remember, this is how the, the cone was. It is knocked off. Remember how this was, this is knocked off. Remember how this was, this is knocked off. And this is how it was. It's knocked. all blues are like oceans. All reds are mountains and blues are ocean. So from mountain to ocean because you knock them off. That is what is the most important thing about this procedure. So, what is IVIS corneal remodeling is about? In 65% of our keratoconus patients improved by 40 to 80% leap in their quality of vision. A blurry vision becomes more crisp. Look at this multiple images becomes crisp. Look at the cornea, becomes more stable. And by a week, most of them are back to work. And this is a simple procedure at this point of time. So what it does is, like I said, the whole bulge of a cornea using a ray tracing concept, it tries to create more better shape of the cornea. The more irregular shape of cornea has multiple images and then what you get is a single sharp image. That's where the whole corneal remodeling is all about and that's what the IVIS does. So we are very proud to bring to you for the first time in the country the corneal remodeling and shaping to change the quality of vision for keratoconus. But again, the decision of how a doctor and what he has to plan has to be based out of his 
discussion, there have to be multiple levels of planning and we will have to go through uh, whether you're eligible, not all people are eligible to see how to go about with this. Like in this case, this is the area where we have to, we have changed this shape into more perfect shape. So thank you and I'll keep you updated with more uh, results.